Mm. This is our 10th competition as planning committee. And if I have learned one thing, it's that if you think you can rest on your laurels planning an event like this, you're going to be served a very, very generous portion of humble pie. <laughs> yeah, a la mode. Barb is the lead volunteer for the carving competition. She's kind of the backbone of the whole thing. This is critical to our event. Great. And that is a green light on using their kitchenette. Boy, that could have gotten ugly. Dennis has become Barb's sort of right-hand man in the last number of years. He's just this all-around goofball. He wants this competition to go so well. He's striving because he has so much passion over this thing. Having someone with his passion has really been good for Barb. Like, I think it's made her really get that extra spark of energy to really take it to the next level. It's perfect. What do you think about the acoustics? Yeah, I can work with that. Dennis and Barb make a great team, so I feel like a lot of people are gonna, gonna love that duo. She's got a lot of pressure, a lot of responsibilities. She puts a lot of time and effort into it and takes great pride in that. Takes it very seriously. Open your eyes, Barb. You got Frank Brunswick next to Ed Masek. That's suicide. I can't do it, it's too much. Pull yourself together! There's 36 people relying on you! You think I don't know that? <laughs>